Hello everyone, Inventor719 here, and in today's video, we are going to be making a lighter magic trick tutorial on how to make a floating flame. All you need for this project is a pair of scissors, a pen, and any one of these types of lighters. It can be a clear dollar store lighter, a Bic lighter, or even a lighter with a button instead of a wheel. The first step is to take your pen, take off the lid, and then kind of using your scissors, start taking the pen apart, take off the cap, and all you're going to need is the ink, put everything else aside, and then very carefully, making sure you're on something you don't mind wrecking a little bit, cut the ink in half, it may splatter, it may ruin the scissors, so don't use your mom's favorite scissors. Now simply set the ink pen aside. Next step, choose the lighter that you want to use. We'll use this blue one just because I know it has gas in it. Set the rest aside. Now for this project, you're going to have to remove some of the safety features. I've already removed the push down to light thing that's usually on the top. And then you can remove the metal casing with brute force usually. You may break the lighter doing this, but just just like I just did, crack it off there so that you can see the internals of the lighter. So the next step here is super easy. As you can see, there's a little tip on the end. Then using that tube of ink you made not long ago, dab the very end of the lighter with the ink, making sure that some of the black ink, I haven't tried with any other colors, but what you want to do is make sure the black ink gets on the tip as you can see it kind of spider webs off and if it doesn't go right away this isn't the safest result but use the flame to heat it up a little bit get the uh, ink to be a little more viscous then just dab it on your lighter and believe it or not that is all you have to do to modify your lighter to make it have a floating flame so that is all you have to do to modify your lighter unfortunately this one here just ran out of butene because you can't see it on the side so I can't show you that one but I did it with this lighter as well which as you can see has lots of fuel left in it so what you're supposed to do is just light it as normal but sometimes if it's cold I find what helps is to have a secondary lighter that you can use just to provide a little extra fuel to the mixture and then once it's started it's usually pretty good as you can see the flame is definitely floating there Then once it's hot, you can light it as normal. Show you guys nice and close. Probably going to burn my camera, but that's okay. I need to upgrade anyway. You guys tell me that all the time. Anyway, there it is. Let's see if I can hold it with that thumb. Looks a little cooler. This, this lighter has been modified, as you have seen possibly in my other video, by twisting this lever on the end. Lefty loosey, righty tighty. You can open and close the amount of fuel. So if yours doesn't look quite this big, that's probably why. If you do want to see how to do that mod as well, check out my video on that, which is why I have to blow it out by hand every time with this lighter. But personally, I would say it looks pretty cool. I'll show you guys once more, unless it doesn't let me. There you go. Pretty cool stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you think.